one of the useful options is searching for a cell. This is done by clicking on this question mark button and then one can choose from the list of cells of all CUMTS cells uh, which cell should be found and when we choose a cell and click on OK the map window would be centered around the chosen cell. Another useful option is toggling auxiliary relapse. Here we have uh, this button. When we click on it, we obtain map tools buttons. One of them is related to streets. So in order to um, toggle the streets on and off, first we must have that table open. File, open, and we'll open this roads demo table that we have prepared. The important rule is the table must have a roads string in the table name. So when it is opened, we can toggle on and off the streets from the map with single click operation. The same holds for toggling terrain and toggling the drive routes. Now, if we remove GSM cells <coughs> so that only UMTS cells are visible, we can test another feature. If for whatever reason we want to change the size of the cells in current map window, we can use that using this option, UMTS cells, set UMTS cell size. The current size is 7. Let's see what happens if we uh, increase the cell size to 10. Remember unit is about 100 meters. This operation can be applied to a specific carrier or to all UMTS cells. We'll choose now the option all and click on OK. So now the size of the cells is different from before. The same way if for uh, whatever reasons we find convenient to change uh, the width of, of the sectors in a map window, we can do it using this operation, select uh, change antenna bandwidth. And then we can choose, let's say from 20 to 90. If we select for example 90 and once again apply to all carriers, this would be result of this editing.